Captain Simeon and the Space Monkeys. behavior. Huh? Well, at least I ain't no yellow belly. Get off this planet ASAP. What's the big rush, Cap? What can these guys do anyway? I mean, besides watch the wells of precious. Well, they can make a real big hole. That's what I always... <laughs> well, I'll be a monkey mother's world. <laughs> Where'd all those come from? They came from your Beamatron, Spider. Remember when you had me pick all the aces out of... All right. I remember, okay? Do you not feel shame that you have cheated and enraged an entire world? What? Is that a trick question or something? Cheated? What does that mean? I just sort of bent the rules a little bit. Nothing serious. To win the game? That's it. You got it exactly. And what precisely do you mean by the term wuss? You, Professor Wuss. If it wasn't for me, those critters would have kicked your butt. Never. Their lack of muscle coordination made it highly improbable that their pedal extremities would have had a deleterious effect on my posterior. Yeah, well, you're still a wood. You are a primitive. Wood. Primitive. Wood. Primitive. Everybody, wuss primitive, wuss primitive. Now, just the women. So the chatter. Looks like the Vlathorians gave us a black eye. A fluxitron shot. 
Orbitron, is that critical? Danger, Will Robinson! Danger! Well, I'll take that as a yes. Captain, the primate Avenger's structural integrity is maintained by means of flux, a natural adhesive that works on the subatomic molecular level. In other parlance, the same thing. An idiotic simplification. Excuse me. The fluxotron is the heart of the ship's circulatory system, Captain. And flux is its life's blood. Did you cheat when you beat me at checkers? Uh... Okay, problem. The ship's coming apart at the seams. Solution? We need more flux. Primary readings indicate that still, the planet below us, is rich in this natural resource, Captain. But I wonder if it would be advisable to... Systems are go. Prepare for launch. Engine ignition in five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Ignition! the most appropriate course of action. We better figure something out before this ship hits the fan. Indeed. It is a matter of even higher priority. I must rid myself of this... this... April. Ship ain't the only thing coming apart. You're cracking up, Humpty Dumpty. Let go of me, you microcephalic. Ow! Ow! Farming! Paramecium! You take that back. What's paramecium? Read a book. I'd love to get a bet down on this. How could I lose? Of course, I couldn't win either. You could always I cheat. I'm not a two. Read out the fluxes all around us, but where? Such a barren place. I fear our intrusion here will endanger the delicate ecosystem. You call this an ecosystem? It is all part of the whole. This planet is a whole, if you ask me. I did not. But it would be immoral to disturb the balance of nature for our own needs, Captain. I can't be concerned with that right now, Shaolin. I've got my ship to think of. Hmm. Instruments indicate flux readings are intensifying, Captain. Check. Where is it? Excuse me. Finally, the Mergitron is complete. If you followed my schematic, the device should have the desired effect. You mean if your scribbles made any cotton picking sense, my doohickey ought to do the trick. So Splitzy will still be Splitzy, but he won't be Splitzy. I do not understand. It is a simple and quite irreversible process, actually. I enter here at the receptacle. The inverse power surge separates the individual brain waves, then merges them, giving precedence to the dominant matrix. And it makes hundreds of Julian flies in seconds. Isn't that amazing? We ain't got seconds. We got now. Say goodbye. It's time. You say goodbye. Don't call me Phil. Splitsy, is that you? Henceforth, kindly address me as Dr. Splits. Call me anything you like. Just don't call me late for dinner. Splitsy! It could be worse. They could be the Olsen twins! Wait, what is it? Never mind. What's happening? Captain, there are two possibilities. A, our flux readings are incorrect. Or B, the entire surface of this planet is made up of flux. I'll go with B. Takes care of that. We work well.
well together, Goddess. Indeed, Captain. But the balance of nature... Yes, Shaolin, balance is what it's all about. Working together as a finely honed unit. Teamwork. Key pain. Gas bag. Cheater. You're all out of your monkey-loving mind. I refuse to work with you. You incompetent boob. You make me want to recycle my grit, you big bag of beans. Come on, Gore. We gotta work together. I am not speaking to you. I promise I won't ever cheat again. How do I know you're not cheating now? Whoa! The ship is breaking up like old Kleenex. Hey, why aren't we being sucked out into space? The holotronic safety field is holding adequately. That will cease and desist without renewed flux. It can. Fluxometer is at critical. Blitzy, you must take Spider and secure all loose components of the craft immediately. Oh, sure. I do all the cotton picking work. Look, you two wackos, and I mean that respectfully. If we don't do something, we're all going to be space blossom. Come on, Spider. We got work to do. Well, Splitsy, um, I mean, Gore, let us commence by stabilizing the front parameter of the inverse fluxtronic triangle. I understood Gore and left. Captain, the wise man knows when to withdraw. Well, I'm a chimpanzee, and I've got him right where I want him. Sometimes there is very little difference between man and chimpanzee. I think I am getting the hang of this. I will retrieve another assemblage so you may persevere in your endeavor to repair the flux drop. And, and may I have another nut so I can go on fixing this machine? Deja vu. Hmm. What connective device would be most difficult for Gore to deconstruct? Perhaps Blitzy was particularly advantaged in some regard. Dr. Split! Come back! This ain't working. What a surprise! I would have thought that duct tape would have done the trick. And you know what? I would have been out of my monkey-loving head. Hello? Anybody home? Is this thing on? Don't you have a plan, an idea, a notion? Nope. Well, I'm out of those. Dr. Split's always had all the good ideas. <sighs> Not a one of them needed duct tape. Face it, I'm half the monkey I used to be. Dr. Split! it would be all right for us to do the same. It would be more than all right, Captain. It would be natural. Squidgy, where are you? We're losing power! What? I am not talking to you, so I am just pointing. Is he out of his monkey-loving skull? What's he doing? It appears he is abandoning ship. Not at all a bad idea. Women in small glowing balls! Help! Help! Thanks, buddy. Help! Spider? I am coming, Spider! Uh, 
I'm coming, Dr. Split. Zoo. The awful zoo. How I loathe it here. The horrible confinement. No other apes with whom to converse. Purgatory. Until Splitsy manifested. Finally, company. I yinned my yang. My other half. Myself. I can almost see him now. Hear his voice. Hey, hey, hey. Yes, it's so, so real. It's me, you big stupid. I'm here to save you, sorry, orange But Splitsy, you've come. You missed me. Oh, tell me your plan, your, your brilliant scheme for my rescue. Uh, typical. But gratifying nonetheless. Guess I'm a day late and a dollar short, Doc. Well, at least we'll check out together. Turning up in an alien atmosphere, like twin over. Speed feeling. Ahoy, Captain! Alas, subspace interference prevents communication. It is a quantum impossibility as well that they will take any notice of us before we are immolated. But wait! Splitsy! Remove your rocket pack and secure it to the rear of this conveyance. Now, wire the control directly into the storeroom illumination system. Secure yourself aft and raise your left leg ten degrees or our trajectory will be disastrous. Okay, let her rip, Doc. Captain, we have a large object approaching. Hang on, I'm getting a visual. Of course not. But whatever it was, let's go get it. Whoa! wrench on a superlative effort. You didn't do so bad yourself, you bag of hot air. <laughs> That's the kind of cooperation I like to see. I'll just change the ship's roster to reflect our new crew member. That would be unnecessary, Captain. We have no intention of remaining in this intolerable condition. We're joining up again. But I thought you said the merger trial was irreversible. What if you both go... It still beats looking at his ugly puss. I couldn't agree more. Actually, I feel very much like a woodpecker in a tree full of grub worms. Come, let us perambulate about the ship and consider our prodigious handiwork. Everything is back in balance, Captain. Back to its natural state of harmony and peace. There. You win, I lose. Did you let me win? Uh... That is the same as cheating! I won't do it again! I promise! What combination are you talking about, you egghead? Well, it's simple English, you monkey man. Yeah, I think I get the balance part, but can you run the harmony and peace bit by me again? <laughs> 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 